Hey there guys, it's Delta49 here with a tutorial on how to install the shaders mod for Minecraft 1.7.10. Now the first thing you want to do is go into your Minecraft launcher. And once this loads up, under any profile, click edit profile. And under use version, select release 1.7.10 and click save profile. Now go ahead and click play. And once this loads up, you can click quick game. That's just to install a new version of Minecraft 1.7.10 for the shaders mod to use. Now go ahead and go into your web browser and head over to the shaders mod forum thread, which is linked in the description and find the for Minecraft 1.7.10 section. Find the non forge edition and click the download link. This will bring you to an ad fly page and wait for the skip ad button to appear in the top right and click skip ad. Now click the blue download button here and save it on your desktop. Now go ahead and go to your desktop and you want to right click the shaders mod file, click open with, click Java platform SE binary and click OK. This will bring up a dialog asking you if you'd like to install the shaders mod in your .minecraft folder and you can click yes and then click OK. Now go into your Minecraft launcher and once this loads up you'll have to re-authenticate your account just click play and then make sure the 1.7.10 shaders mod profile is selected and click play. Once Minecraft loads up, if you go into your options, you will see that there is a new shaders option. We can go ahead and for now select the internal option and then let's just go test it out in a world. You can see that there's not too much of a difference and what you will need for the actual shaders to take effect is a shader pack. So for this tutorial, I will be using the Sonic Ethers Unbelievable Shaders and you can use many different types of shaders as long as they are compatible and I will leave a link to a few different ones so you can choose from those. So what you want to do is just go ahead and save and quit and quit game. You can also close the launcher. Then you want to go into your web browser and again as an example we're going to be downloading the Sonic Ethers Unbelievable Shaders so you want to navigate to the Sonic Ethers Unbelievable Shaders thread. You want to scroll down and find the download section. And then we're going to download the standard version here. Wait for the skip ad button to appear in the top right of the ad fly page. And click skip ad. You'll need to agree to the EULA and then click download. Save this on your desktop. And once it is on your desktop, Press the Windows key and the R key, type percent %APPDATA% percent, and click OK. Now go into your .minecraft folder, your shader packs folder, and drag the Sonic Ethers Unbelievable shaders into the shader packs folder. You can close that and let's go ahead and test it out. So now open up your Minecraft launcher make sure the shaders mod profile is selected and click play. We can go ahead and go into options, shaders, and select the Sonic Ethers shader mod and we'll go into a world and test it out. Now you can see that the shaders are thoroughly working and thoroughly doing their shading and uh, yes this is the end of the tutorial, but if you did find this helpful, a like and a share would be greatly appreciated. Also, if you do have any questions, you can leave those in the comments below, and I will try to help you out to the best of my ability. And of course, something to keep in mind is that the shaders mod is very intensive on your computer, and if you uh, do not have a great computer, it may not be able to run but there also may be some other things going on there, so definitely leave a comment, explain your problem, and I'll try to help you out the best I can. If you're not already following me on Twitter, haven't liked my Facebook fan page, or are not following me on Google+, Plus, all of those links are down in the description below. And if you're new to the channel and you do enjoy gaming tutorials and reviews, make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching.